everyone and welcome back to my channel i hope you are doing good so in this video i'll be continuing with the integration of razor pay payment gateway in php so in my previous video i have shown you the front end part like how to send your data and how to get key id and secret from your dashboard so in this video i will show you how to verify the signatures and response you get from the razor pay payment gateway so i suggest you to watch my my first integration video so that you can get the clarity what I am doing right now so now let me show you what I have done in previous video so enterprise and click on pay now so now you can see there is one pop-up opening for razor pay and if I will click on card then I need to get the test card details so just get the test card details and fill here so from test get the card number of visa and paste write any expiry let's say 922 and write any cvv click on pay and you can see there is success failure click on success and that's the response we will be getting from razor pay payment gateway so we need to verify this signature so you can clearly see what all are the fields we are getting in response so first one is payment id then there is order id signature organization logo organization name is there or checkout logo is there and custom branding is there so now let me show you code so firstly you can see i have opened controller in which you can see razorpay.php is loaded and api is used so first one is index function in which you can see the first home page that is loaded where i'm entering price then there is checkout that is page for pop-up of razor pay and last is payment status so here i will be getting response of my payment gateway so now let me show you view so that's the form and that's the callback url you can see here payment slash payment status so now let's go and start work on response so now let's fetch the post data and hold that in a variable so first one is payment id so write payment Razor pay payment ID equals to this input post and pass the same key. After that, I need order ID and three things I need. First one is payment ID, order ID and signature ID. So get all these three things. So now let me show you in the documentation. So step four is store fields in your server. So I have stored them in variables. So you can store them as and like if you want to store them in your database. So you can do that as well. So and fifth one is to verify the signature. So just copy the code and paste it in your controller. So you can see this one is using hash technique that is SHA256. So first one is order ID. So you can I already get that. So just pass that. Then there is payment ID. Pass that as well. Then there is secret. So I have already taken that from dashboard. So from above function copy and paste in this function after that there is one if condition if generated signature is equal to razor pay signature then payment is successful else payment is failed so now you can see razor pay signature i'm getting from response and generated signature i have just generated it so just eco payment is successful if payment is actually successful else eco payment failed so if payment is successful then you can do two things you can redirect to your own success page and you can save that to database so now let's go and check in browser so click on refresh continue so now you can see there is one error for call to undefined function so okay i need to change this so let me write data so here I'm passing order ID dot and uh, then payment ID. So there is another function we will be calling instead of HMAC SHA256. And instead of this function, I need to change it to hash underscore hmac and you can see algo data key. Three things it takes. So first one algo is SHA256 data i am passing order id and payment id combination key is our secret 
so let's go and refresh our browser continue so you can see now payment is successful so that's how you can verify the response of razor pay so instead of payment is successful you can redirect to your own payment success page and you can insert in your db so that's all in this video so i have shown you the complete process of how to integrate razor pay payment gateway in your project so if you have any query just comment down below in the comment section thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching